I understand we're here to, to talk specifically about what's going on with Loper football and, and some of the news that's happening. Uh, I will share with you that uh, Coach Lamerson informed me last Wednesday that uh, he had an opportunity to look at a position at Abilene Christian University in Texas. On Thursday and Friday, the two of us spent several hours talking about the opportunity and uh, looked closely at his personal and professional situation, and I tried to give him as much advice and support as I possibly could. Uh, he and his wife, Manny, left on Sunday to go down to, to Abilene. They spent the day with the uh, athletic director and, and the other administrators and, and uh, newly named uh, head coach Adam Dorrell, who was a friend of his and an individual that he worked with for several years at Northwest Missouri State. Uh, on Monday, uh, Coach Dorrell was announced as the, the head football coach at Abilene Christian University, and uh, Coach Lamerson was uh, at the press conference, and so as we know, things kind of circulated from there uh, with regard to people knowing that he was interested in this position. We are very sad to see Coach Lamerson go. He became a trusted and valued colleague and friend, not only to myself, but to our coaches in the athletic department, to a lot of people that have worked intimately and closely with him, and to our student athletes. I know that this decision weighed really hard on him. It took him seven days to come to this point. And our conversations, not only did it revolve around the business of the change and the transition, but it was at the core of who he is and, and ultimately his vision and his dream for where he wants to go. After Josh and I finished our meeting, uh, we went uh, downstairs and met specifically with our assistant coaches. We had a very candid and, di and, and direct dialogue about our future and where we're going and uh, the process that we will take. We have a very tight window here, folks. Uh, we have between now and, and January 12th where we've got to find a new coach. Um, on January 12th, we have official visits that are starting. We have probably 150 student athletes that will be coming to campus to visit our institution between January 12th and the end of January because National Signing Day is on February 1st. So for us, this is not just about finding a head football coach, but this is about getting ourselves positioned so that we can attract, recruit, get commitments, and sign the best class that we can in preparation for 2017. I've asked Jake Wilrick to step up and be a leader for the program. Uh, we don't have time to file for an interim leadership role as a, a, a temporary head coach, so he's gonna take the reins and lead the current staff in their positions as such. So our goal now is to position ourselves and get us ready for, for the next step of Loper football the next chapter and the new opportunity that somebody has to, to come in and take over for, for a program that I feel is on the upward side and moving in the right direction. Perfect. Thank you folks, have a great day. Happy holidays.